When it comes to fine tuning your filter system, it's important to know which filtration media will best suit your process. Failure to implement the right filter media may result with issues within your system, adding costs to your overall expenses. This leaves you with two options. Use a two-dimensional filter cloth such as DTWS, or use a three-dimensional filter cloth such as RPD High Flow S. In this video, we're gonna break down filter cloths variants their cost, and their performance capabilities to give you a better idea of which one will best work for your filtration needs. Let's get started. Hi, I'm Eric, the sales manager of Industrial Woven Wire here at WS Tyler. While DTW and RPD High Flow can be used in similar applications, there are several performance differences, which makes using one over the other better depending on the situation. Today, we'll break down these differences to ensure you find the correct filtration that your company needs. Mini Mesh DTWS is our Dutch twilled filter weave that is constructed out of thin weft wires woven as close together as possible. Its classic 2-2 weave accommodates optimal throughput with very small pore size. Mini Mesh RPD High Flow S is a three dimensional filter cloth weave that offsets two layers of filter cloth, doubling the pore openings and surface area of the filter. The unique manufacturing of RPD High Flow S allows us to use various alloys that feature corrosion and temperature resistant properties. To that end, as DTW is constructed from fine wires to create a tight weave, most corrosion and temperature resistant alloys cannot be used. RPD High Flow has a depth structure which allows high separation efficiencies with limited binding. This helps to facilitate longer filtration cycles between cleanings. When compared to RPD High Flow, DTW has a thicker, more robust construction. This, along with its tight pore distribution, allows DTW to deliver exact separation without compromising the integrity of the mesh specifications. The most significant difference between RPD High Flow and DTW is the flow rate achievable with RPD High Flow. RPD High Flow's design doubles the pore openings of a two-dimensional weave type. It's also proven to offer twice the permeability of DTW filters with an identical pore size. The offset configuration of RPD High Flow filters allows them to deliver optimal flow rate and to be cleaned with ease. The unique offset design of the filters allows them to be purged with minimal pressure, allowing them to eliminate any plugged particles. To that end, DTW filters are woven in a way that create blocked areas that are harder to clean. This requires noticeably more pressure when purging the filters. Despite all the differences between RPD High Flow and DTW filter cloth, the pore size that your filtration system requires is vital on deciding which one will work for you. With that said, RPD filter cloth has pore sizes that range from 5 to 40 micron, whereas DTW filter cloth has pore sizes that range from 7 to 120 microns. There is no price difference between RPD high flow and DTW. Prices are subject to change depending on layer configuration, size, shape, and mesh count. DTW and RPD High Flow go hand in hand and are used in identical applications. Industries such as oil, gas, pharmaceuticals, plastics, and aerospace can all benefit from these types of filter cloths. The weave type that is ultimately right for you comes down to your filtration operation needs. 
If you'd like to learn more about filtration, we have a learning center filled with written and video content designed to make you an expert. Just click on the link in the description. To stay up to date on everything WS Tyler, make sure you hit the subscribe button and the notification bell right next to it. Once again, I'm Eric. Thank you for watching and have a nice day.